Hi, I'm Dr. Shannon Fraser and I'm the Chief of the Division of General Surgery at the Jewish General Hospital. You're about to watch a demonstration on the correct technique of surgical scrubbing. Now, when I was a student and I was learning this, this was a very intimidating process as the OR nurses were very strict on the timing and on the procedure. Now the techniques and the products have changed, but the essential goal is the same, is to decrease the bacterial load on your hands to help prevent an infection happening to your patient. Prior to application, remove all jewelry from hands and forearms, including rings, watches, and bracelets. Fingernails should be kept short and well-maintained. No nail polish and no artificial nails. Hands and forearms must be free of open lesions and breaks in skin integrity. Have on complete operating room attire, including a surgical mask and protective eyewear. The scrub brushes, mask, and visor mask are on the opposite wall of the scrub sink. To start water, press the front panel of the sink with your knee. To stop water, press again. Take the scrub brush package, remove the brush and nail cleaner from the wrapper. Hands above the elbow for the duration of the scrub. Wet hands. Apply the antimicrobial agent from the sponge brush to the hands. While holding the sponge, clean nails with disposable nail cleaner under running water. Discard nail cleaner in receptacle. Rinse hands thoroughly. Use the plastic brush side of the sponge to scrub the four sides of each finger for 30 seconds. Repeat this process for the fingers on the opposite hand. Then detach the plastic brush from the sponge and discard into the waste receptacle. Scrub hand and fingers with sponge containing the antimicrobial agent. Scrub all four sides of your hands and fingers thoroughly for one minute, keeping the hand elevated. Repeat this process for the opposite hand and fingers. Wet forearms. Scrub forearm and arms up to three inches above the elbow with the sponge containing the antimicrobial agent. Scrub all four sides of your forearm and arms thoroughly for one minute and repeat this process for the opposite forearm and arm. Discard sponge in waste receptacle. Note, duration of the antimicrobial surgical scrub is three to five minutes, not more or less, and please use the clock. Rinse hands and arms thoroughly. Keep hands raised above elbows and away from surgical scrubs. Proceed to the OR. Enter back first while keeping hands above the elbow at 90 degrees and away from surgical scrubs. Prior to application, remove all jewelry from hands and forearms, including rings, watches, and bracelets. Wash hands thoroughly with soap and water for the first use of the day and when visibly soiled. Clean under nails with a disposable nail cleaner under running water. Rinse hands thoroughly under running water. Dry hands thoroughly using a paper towel. Hands should be clean and dry and must be free of open lesions and breaks in the skin integrity prior to application of the alcohol-based antiseptic solution. Application. Cup hand and hold one to two inches from the nozzle. To activate the distributor, place your hand under. Dip the fingers of the opposite hand into the hand rub and work it under the nails. Spread the remaining hand rub over the hand and up to three inches above elbow covering all surfaces. Dispense another pump of hand rub into the palm of the other hand. Dip the fingertips of the opposite hand into the hand rub and work it under the nails. Spread the remaining hand rub over the hand, around each finger, and up to three inches above the elbow, covering all surfaces. Rub thoroughly until dry. When done, raise arms to 90 degrees and enter operating room back first. Remember to wash your hands with soap and water at the end of each procedure. 